Hello, I am Velo Dreamer, and this is my first uh, English speaking video. I am now I am in Ireland. This place, uh, owner of this place is Dwayne Phillips. He's a very good guy, bicycle lover, and adv adventurist. And he let us, me and my wife, to live here and let me to work here. Uh, this week um, my company have, uh, I have a regular, regular, regular job here in Ireland. Uh, this week is a um, week off, is something like holidays. Um, so I have three, uh, I have four days to build Velomobile body. This is mold of my newest Velomobile Moby Dick. It's XL version, it's very large, it's really big. Uh, but it's for very big people. So for me it will be too big, but I think. Um, it's better than nothing, so I can use it. I I would like to make a Velomobil, working prototype, on the ne uh, next uh, nearest two months. So, the today is first day when I will start to make a Velomobil. This place is not very good for making, Velomobiles because it's actually no not workshop. It's just garden must be, and it's very very small. It's very small house, very small workshop, a garage. It's not not workshop. And this uh, we build this temporary workshop for me with Dwayne. But in here I cannot uh, make big, big, uh, big scenes from fiberglass like Valon do. So I I will need to make a little outside. And it's this island rains raining very often, so I have limits because of raining. So I need to stop. Also, I have seat making process here. It must be worn up, I, I suppose, to avoid these distortions. And new seats. So, I am trying to to make my life as as it was in Ukraine from the beginning to, to make my company with velomobiles in some some day in future. So let's start. First of all I need to disassemble parts of mo of the mold and put first layer of first layer is um, release agent so called PVA PVA he is he is packing materials thank you very much Yasha Butler for delivering this mold from from Ukraine it's like a miracle and we have it here and you can see how big it is. I think it's for it's it will be good for people almost two meters tall and very wide. This is seventy. 72 millimeter, uh, centimeters wide. Uh, 
uh, for example, or, or maybe even 76. For example, Vav have 62. But I hope uh, it will be maybe not not faster for the mobile, but fast enough. And after this prototype, I will make smaller vers version for people like me. Small, only 60 kilos weight. So it must be good in the future. First step is to ta take molds apart. So I need to unscrew these bolts like this. Ah! This red water is rest of old release agent, so it's normal. I I need to wash it. Now the mold is disassembled and are disassembled and I need to wash it. To wash this red material. And it's gone away. Oof. Okay, this is done. Next step is to put PVI release agent on the surface, off the surface. I try to not, not, not put dirt, dirt on it, only release agent. very important to make it very well because if in some place will no re release agent the molds can be destroyed during the extracting yeah. okay now th that part of work is finished I finished and most dangerous for now is rain. If rain will start, all my work will be cancelled. I hope that rain will not start. Now I need to wait while all this surface will be dry. Absolutely dry. Like it's Almost, I think, maybe half, of one, maybe one hour, for sure. Okay, it's ready to the next step. Next step is half assembling. I need to assemble upper part of the mold. Lower, lower part will be. Uh, separately uh, because it's more more easy to work with all molds so let's take it together I'm trying to film how it's making by one hand it's not very 
dvere good so Now it's assembled and tied up. So I need to move this bolts. strange spider the mold have some damage but it's not critical Especially for prototype. It can be fixed on the mobile body after it will be extract of the molds. So in general molds is 95% go good. Little damage here. I think it was hit on this part, but it's okay. And now we will use this Greek natural yogurt to cover this mold. It's a, it is joke. It's not yogurt. It's gel coat. Every kilograms, every gram that will be added now in the mold will increase weight of one mobile. So I am trying to make tin yogurt, uh, <laughs> tin layer of this gel coat to not increase the weight as much as possible. And it is very good to do this outside because it's pretty toxic. And if I will be in some room, I must have a mask, a respirator. But now outside it's not necessary. Camera just falls and stuck, so I don't know. I don't know if it was filming. So I 
I have used, I think, half of a kilo for all the surface, so it's very good. Now, let's continue here. Now first layer insert code is on place. It look like not so bad. Not, not perfect. Because it's not, not very not very smooth. But I will try to make second layer more, more smoothly. Now I need to wait, I think, one day. It's, it's sticky, but it start, definitely start to. To hard, hardness, hardness. So tomorrow I will continue this work. See you tomorrow.